Hey guys, today I'm gonna share five rules to lose weight. This is part one of the 10 rules that I have to lose weight and today I'm gonna give you five, okay? Before I start, I just wanna say that the focus of us should not be just to solely lose weight, but our focus should be into being a healthier person, having a healthy body, having a healthy lifestyle. All right, so let's start with the five rules to lose weight. Number one is eat. Many times people wanna lose weight and they just deprive themselves of food. Error, that is not good. You do not wanna do it. It's not about eating less, it's about what kinds of foods you are eating. The great thing about following a plant-based diet based on fruits, vegetables, nuts, seeds, legumes, and starches is that you can eat in abundance. You can eat as much as you want and you don't have to worry about gaining weight. In fact, these foods are gonna help you lose weight, maintain your weight, and essentially get to a healthy weight for your body. These foods will also nourish your body, will nourish your cells, and you'll have more energy, and you'll be in a better mood, and you'll be more focused to achieve the goals that you want and just to function better on a day-to-day -day basis. These foods are full of fiber, water, vitamins, and minerals, and will keep you satiated for longer periods of time. Number two is just for today. Taking it one day at a time and making short-term goals will most of the time function better than just focusing on the long-term goals. So something that you can do is that you can go to my website, ravana.com, in the challenges part. I have challenges of five days, seven days, 10 days, and 14 days. And the cool thing about these challenges is that I give you the menu for each day. So if you take any of these menus, you can simply one day program yourself, plan what you're gonna eat the next day, and maybe replace one or two meals for raw vegan or vegan meals. This way, you're just taking it one day at a time, and believe me, doing small steps, small things every day, in the end, you'll see long-term results. Number three is don't be so hard on yourselves and keep a positive mental attitude. I know that losing weight is not always the easiest thing in the world. And if we fall into the negative thinking, it can be easy to just give up. One of the things for you to be successful on your weight loss is to keep a positive mental attitude. Of course, eating more fruits and veggies, exercising, sleeping well, and drinking water are gonna help a lot. But what you think about yourself and believe about yourself takes part in every aspect of our lives. If you have a bad day when you eat something that you probably shouldn't have eaten or you didn't go work out because you were tired or you didn't have time, it's fine. If you fall down, just simply get up again. Trust, keep on going, and before you know it, you're gonna look back and you will see results. Number five, your mentality is everything. See this new journey where you're going to learn so many things, not just about food and what you're putting into your body, but you're also going to learn a lot about yourself. You're truly going to connect to your inner self. You are going to learn to listen to your body. You're going to know what it likes, what it doesn't like. You're going to heal your body, but at the end, you're really just going to find out that this physical body is not your body. What we truly are is the spirit that is within us. And why not live life the best way that we can live it? When we have a healthy body, when we feel good about ourselves, when we have positive mental thoughts, when, when we have a positive mental attitude, we're just able to function better. We're better, we're able to function the way that we were designed to be, to be happy and be in harmony with our mind, body, and spirit. So all I can say is start by making small changes day to day. Don't deprive yourself of foods that you still wanna eat. If you do this, it's just gonna put more stress on your body and losing weight and turning to a healthy lifestyle is just gonna be harder. So all I can say is just incorporate more fruits and vegetables. If you make that just your one goal, if you say, okay, every single day, I'm gonna replace breakfast for a smoothie. Start by doing that. Before you know it, your body's alone gonna crave more. And then when you eat the other things like processed foods, animal protein, it's gonna resent it and you're not even gonna want it. And this will eventually create new habits and a change of lifestyle. 
But the best part is that you're gonna do it all on your own. You are the only one who can take charge of your health. Every single day, at every single meal, we have a decision of what we're gonna put into our body. And if we're just conscious of how it's gonna affect us, not only physically, but mentally and emotionally, and we make decisions based on that consciousness, then we are on the right path. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like it if you liked it and subscribe here to my channel if you haven't subscribed and also leave you my Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. I would love to know your comments on this video, what your thoughts are, if you have any other suggestions and stay tuned for part two of my 10 rules to lose weight. Okay, see you guys later, bye.